This is the X07 receiver. It's an extremely versatile receiver as it has single onboard relay, which allows it to operate as a single channel receiver. What makes it unique are these six additional outputs, which then turns this receiver into a seven channel receiver. This is one of the relay modules which can be added onto the EXO. You simply by plugging it onto any chosen channel, you can add up to six of these modules onto the, to the EXO. They are high powered relays, they can take up to 230 volts. So any application, for instance, switching on lights, pool pumps, electric fences, the possibilities are, are endless with these, these relays, what you can do with them. It should be noted that uh, there is a 12, 24 volt jumper on the relay. So whatever power supply is going in to power the relay, you would need to select 12 or 24 volts before you actually operate it. Another feature that you can use is what we call an open collector. These are for your low power triggers, anything up to 80 milliamps. For instance, your loop, your trigger, your pedestrian on a gate motor or garage motor. And again, you simply plug that end onto whichever channel you choose and that end would go onto the trigger on your gate motor, your garage motor, whatever you're actually operating. So this is an example of an open collector connected in this case from channel one to the pedestrian input on the gate PC board. It could obviously be connected to trigger or loop. What you'll also note is that the ground on the PC board is connected to the ground on the EXO. That's quite an important point to remember. What we have done in this case is we've programmed the yellow button to channel one on the EXO. So now you'll see when we press the button on the remote, the pedestrian LED comes on on the PC board. So that trigger is actually coming from the EXO through to pedestrian. So that's the open collector triggering the pedestrian input on the PC board. Here we've got four relays, each one connected to a separate channel on the EXO, channel one, channel two, three, and four. This is to demonstrate that each relay can do different things. In order to demonstrate the versatility of each relay, we've connected lights to the relays. So what we've done, we've programmed one button to all four channels on the EXO. So when we press the button, you'll see all four lights will come on and then they'll individually switch off. And that's determined by the pulse time that we've set on each relay. So there you can see all four lights are on and they're individually switching off after their selected pulse time. You can also choose one button to operate a single channel. For instance, we can switch one light on. We can choose another button to switch one of the other lights on. So it is extremely versatile as what you can do with the X07. It's important to remember that these relays can be used for any number of applications, not only switching lights on. It could be, for instance, bypassing your beams, switching on an electric fence, switching an alarm on or off. The possibilities are endless as to what these relays can actually do. Days. Full control. Endless possibilities.